hello everybody today i am going to have a look at the newly launched odoo 13 uh, we are going to look at enterprise version and we are going to see how what is the first impressions of the new odoo enterprise version uh, it is not going to be a detailed review i'm just going to have a look and give you my feedback and my version of the story how the new version looks like okay today the focus area would be to see leave management system uh, the leave management system seems to have been renamed as time off so i don't know how it is going to sit down with uh, most organizations who pretty much call it leave management still so i'm sure there are going to be many requests uh, to rename uh, the this module uh, let's go inside the module uh, as we go in uh, it's a wide view module so i can see that the default view is a calendar view and from the calendar view itself i have a window for request as well which is good and interesting i also have a list view which is fine nothing new and uh, okay this is an activity view that i can see fair enough let's start with configuration under configuration i have the standard leaf types which is time of types now let's check is there is something new okay one thing that i observe is that there is a linkage to payroll code we will see if it has an actual connection with payroll or maybe it is just a denominator or a factor to be visible in reports uh, it is also mentioning time off in terms of day half day and hour so we have a division maybe when we choose hours and when we take this leave maybe we'll be able to choose whether it's a half day hours and so on we also have validation definition for leaves which is defined in the leave type itself so either there is no validation time of officer which is leave officer team leader and time officer so these are some of the things which are predefined in leave management which is good uh, validity so we can define how long this leave will be valid fair enough uh, no allocation needed free allocation request and allocated by hr only this is something new that has been added initially the feature was for new no allocation but now we hr specific allocation has already been refined i guess what uh, odoo has done is to see see the feedbacks from all corners of the globe what are the most common requests and they try to incorporate in the standard version uh, needless to say for uh, my time off i can have a dashboard view where i can see uh, my request which we store as the default view my time of request let's have a look okay uh, leave form has pretty much shrunk uh, i can choose a particular type okay we have not chosen a particular type let's create one and see what kind of changes it comes with let's say sick leave i'm not very comfortable with the fact that it has been renamed time off and i'm going to stick with leave if I say it has to be validated by multiple people responsible okay it's mandatory I make it save let's create a request and see how it works okay it has taken one by default description and I click on approve mm, okay it is asking me the standard warnings maybe in a detailed review we will have a look but uh, there are going to be many requests for a lot of complex leave allocation rules but i think some of the things have been taken care and in everyone i guess every records will be visible and there are calendar views in terms of which days leaves are present maybe when we go for detailed review we'll see the fields which are available same with manager allocations and time of report is also available okay so that's all for uh, a quick uh, first impressions of the time off or rather 
leave management module for a detailed review kindly tu stay tuned uh, will be coming shortly thank you